right, friends, today we're going to be playing a game that's a little bit like Splat. How it works is I draw some objects, I'll show you the objects, I'll erase some objects, and then you have to tell me how many I erased. Let's start with the first one. I'll help you. This time I'm going to draw dots. You should count how many dots there are. How many dots am I showing you? That's right, there are eight dots. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We have eight dots to start. Now I'm going to erase some. Get ready. How many dots did I erase? You can say you erased mm, and I know because mm. Make sure you tell me how you know. How many dots did I erase? That's right, I erased two dots minus two. Maybe you know because you saw the missing dots. You saw that there, those two dots weren't in their spots. Or maybe you knew because we had eight and now we have only six. And the difference between eight and six is two. Listen, I have eight fingers up. Now I have six fingers up. Now I have eight, six, eight, six. The difference is two. Eight is two more than six. Six is two less than eight. Eight minus two equals six. Are you ready for the next one? How many stars are there? Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I have seven stars to start. Now I'm going to erase some. How many stars did I take away? You can say, Miss Minion, you took away mm, and I know because mm. Do you know? If you're not sure, count the number of stars left. One, two, three, four, five, six. There were seven. Now there's only six. How many did I take away? That's right, I took one away. Seven minus one equals six. Let's do one more. How many squares do I have? Count them. That's right, I have 10 squares. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I have 10 to start. Now I'm going to erase some. How many did I erase? You can say, Miss Minion, you took away mm. I know because mm. That's right, I took away four. And how many do I have left? I have six left. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's kind of like a tens frame. We have a full five and then one more. 10 take away four equals six. Are you ready to see your homework? Here is your math homework. Solve the following problems. Some are the erasing game and some are the splat game. Write a subtraction sentence to show what happened. Bonus, can you create your own erasing problem for someone in your family? Resuelve los siguientes problemas. Algunos son el juego de borrar y otros son el juego de splat. Escribe una oración de subtracción para mostrar lo que sucedió. 
Bonificación. Puedes crear tu propio problema de borrada para alguien de tu familia. Here's your first homework problem. How many rectangles do I have? How many rectangles did I take away? Write a number sentence to show what I did. Press pause while you do this. Press play to check your work. Press the rewind button if you want to see me take them away again. Here's my number sentence. I had five rectangles. I took away two. And now I have three left. Ready to try a different one? This one is going to be with dots. All right, let's look at this. Ready? There are some dots. Count them. Write down how many dots on your board. This says, how many blue shapes do you see? Make sure you write it down on your board. Splat! How many dots are under the splat? Remember, you can use these dots to help you. Draw a picture if it will make it easier. Sometimes it helps to draw it on your whiteboard and cross some out to figure out how many are under the splat. Pause the video while you figure it out. Make sure you know how many are under the splat and you write a number sentence to show what happened. Ready to check your work? How many shapes are under the splat? How do you know? You can say, Miss Minion, my answer is mmm, and I know because mmm. How else could you know? Is there another way you could figure it out? Maybe you use a picture, but you also could figure it out with your fingers. Let's look under the splat to see how many shapes there are. There are two. Let's write a number sentence. Nine, take away two minus two equals seven. There were nine dots. Then I took away two with the splat. And that gave me seven left over. Let's do one more. How many dots are there? Make sure you write it on your whiteboard. You might want to draw it too. Press pause while you work. Press play when you're ready for the splat. Splat! How many dots are under the splat? Use the one left over to help you think about it. You might want to draw a picture or use your fingers. Are you ready to check your work? If not, press pause again. Press play only when you're ready. There are three dots under the splat. Let's check our number sentence. Our dots minus three dots, take away three that were under the splat, equals one dot left. And the last homework problem we'll do today is another erasing problem. You ready? How many hearts are there? Count them. Now I'm going to erase them. How many did I erase? Say Miss Minion, my answer is mmm. And I know because mmm.
This is a tricky one. Can you write a number sentence to match? Are you ready to check your work? Press pause while you work. Only press play when you're ready to check it. That's right, I took away zero. Five hearts, take away zero equals five hearts left over. I took away nothing, so it didn't change. If you want a challenge today, try and do an erasing problem with some objects on your whiteboard. See if you can trick someone in your family. Start by drawing some objects, then make them close their eyes, erase some objects, and then have them open. Can they figure out how many objects you erased? Can you work together to write a number sentence to match what happened? Bonus points if you can stump your mom or your dad or your aunt or your uncle or a grown-up. 